Hello, I'm Thomas with Special Event Sales, and today we're going to talk about steaks. Not the steaks that you eat, but the kind of steaks that holds tents or anchor tents into the ground. So we got two steaks here that I wanted to talk about the differences with. This one here is a forged steak, one inch by 42, and then this is a welded steak, again, one by 42. These are the ones that we sell here, these forged ones, but the white one here we do not sell because we do not recommend them under any circumstances to use a tent like a tent steak like this. Um, so I'm going to go over some of the differences here. Even though both of these are rated as a 1 by 42 inch steak, on the white one here, because the bar is welded down, you actually have about uh, four inches less holding power. So there's four inches less of the white stake in the ground than there is the darker one here. So that actually is quite a significant amount of holding power that you're losing with this stake. The other issue with this stake is the flat bar here has been welded on. You can see a weld on both sides here. And because of the heat of this, being applied to the rod, it makes it very brittle at this point. So it's susceptible to cracking off at this point here, and that can be dangerous. Another issue is, this is a one inch diameter, but there's actually no head to pound the stake with. Um, it's just the straight rod all the way through. So with the forged stake here, you have double the surface area to hit with your sledgehammer. So it's much easier to drive. You don't have to be quite as accurate with your sledgehammer when you're driving a stake like this because you have double the surface area to hit. Another issue with this stake is the top will mushroom over time. And I'm just gonna put this stake down. So this here mushrooms out over top and it gets very sharp, so easy to cut yourself on. And the bigger problem is that shards of this metal will fly off from time to time and be an injury hazard, especially to your eyes. So in any case, we always recommend wearing uh, eye protection, safety goggles when you're pounding stakes. Um, so again, we recommend that you use a forge stake it's the double head design, so if you're uh, using it on a steak bar or on base plates, you always have this second secondary area here to pull your steak from. It's ideally suited to use a Green Monster steak puller on or uh, even the manual pullers. So again, always insist on a forged steak when anchoring your tents. Thank you.